he will guide me with his eye. Now he'll only guide me with his eye if I've got my eye on him and if there's nothing between, right? If something gets in the way, then I can't see what he likes and dislikes. And when people say to me, what's wrong with this or what's wrong with that? Well, I don't say it, but I sometimes wonder if maybe they're in the dark. If we walk in the light, as he is in the light, in other words, if our lives are transparent and open to him, well, then we have fellowship one with another. I can see his face. He can guide me with his eye. I do know what he's thinking. And I don't need a Bible verse for it if it makes it awkward between me and the Lord Jesus. If, um, if it makes it harder for me to study my Bible or harder to pray or harder to witness or, well, I don't need a chapter and verse for that. Let the peace of God, the word shalom means the, the sense of well-being, the, the settled rest, the conscious enjoyment of God. Let that be the umpire in your heart. That's one of the evidences of this wonderful friendship that we have, that I want to know what he wants. That's my desire. Bill McDonald on one occasion tells a story of walking around a lake and he, he came on a woman with a little dog coming the other way and they stopped to talk and they began talking about the dog. And she said to him, you know, my dog just wants two things. He wants to know what I want and then he wants to do it. And as Bill left that woman, he said, oh God, make me like that little dog. I just want to know what you want and then I want to do it. I, I get up in the morning and go into his presence and I say, Lord, I've had my will and I don't like it. I, at first I think I do, but it always turns out bad. And, and I found that your will is really the happy way to live. There really is such a thing as the will of God. And he wants me to know it. And what's the condition for knowing the will of God? I don't have to be smart. I just have to be willing to do it, right? If any man will do his will, he shall know of the doctrine, whether it's of God, the teaching, whether it's of God or no. You want to know if this is of God? Well, if you're willing to do his will, whatever the cost, more than anything else, he says, I'll show it to you. It's not a scavenger hunt. I'm not playing games with you. It's, um, it's just that I want you to be willing before I show it to you. He wants us to trust him. Really, Christianity comes down to this. Jesus loves me. And I love him because he first loved me. And I don't want anything to get in the way. He will guide me with his eye.